The Dutch Center for Translational Molecular Medicine, CTMM, is dedicated to the development of medical technologies. New technologies that enable the design of new personalized treatments and a rapid translation of these treatments to the patient. Universities, academic medical centers, and large enterprises are involved in this process. And it also involves more than 65 small and medium enterprises, most of these originating from the Netherlands. The public-private partnership CTMM brings all these parties together to obtain the best results for patients and to realize healthcare savings and economic and societal benefits. Three innovative SME companies, each a partner of CTMM, will tell you about their most ambitious objectives and interesting products. The first company is Skyline Diagnostics, partner in the CTMM Biochip Project in the disease area of cancer. Here I have him, the AML profiler. What is it actually? What can we do with this? So what you can do with it, it's a, it's a chip and it's meant to, to determine which type of leukemia a patient has. So the, the methodology is that there's, on this chip there's all these tiny little dots and each dot is meant to determine the expression of a single gene. And there's many dots on them so it measures many different genes uh, at the same time in one uh, sample. So you have an AML patient uh, you have to take bone marrow from that patient and AML is disease of the bone marrow so you actually use the cancer material of the patient you through a, a variety of steps you put it ultimately on this chip and then all the different dots will light up in a different way and from that pattern you'll be able to deduct uh, which type exactly of AML the patient is suffering from and within which period of time can we know with uh, the profiler the results, the diagnose? Yeah, so, so f with the AML profile, it's possible within four days. Within four days? Yeah. And that's uh, fairly fast. And it's already applied? Definitely. Glycocheck is another CTMM partner, part of the PREDICT project and active in the field of cardiovascular diseases. What do we see uh, over here? What is she measuring, actually? Well, what we are uh, doing over here uh, is uh, my colleague is measuring uh, under the tongue, sublingually, uh, looking into the small microvascular uh, structures uh, over there. Uh, and what you see is the red blood cell flowing through the capillaries. Uh, and basically what we do is we computate from these flows, we computate the um, the resistance, basically the, the, uh, the uh, perfused boundary region, as we call it, which is a parameter for vascular health. So in other words, this is a non-invasive, real-time measurement of your vascular health, which is unheard of, uh, considering uh, the fact that uh, um, you will be able to, to have an exact value within two minutes. Virtual Proteins is also a very innovative company and partner of the CTMM Learn project. All right, we're both wearing the glasses right now. What do we actually see? Uh, we're looking at a, a 3D data set of a patient. It's a control check of a bypass intervention. Oh, wow. And uh, what you see in a 3D model is, and uh, she's pointing at it right now, inside the... Uh, you see around the heart, you see the bypass coming yes. from the aorta. Yes. You see it all around the heart and on the, on the other side it's going back in. Uh, so it's, it's very helpful because if, if you look at the slices uh, in the grayscale and you have to find your bypass. This is much better. Yes. It's an enormous improvement right. for everybody. Right. And, and, the, and the whole idea is that the the slices are still the same. So the data that you enter into the system is the same as all the data that's been used already in all hospitals, but we represent it on a different way. And that's the reason why you can see it live and in a very beautiful stereo way. It's all, it gives you a lot of information about depth, and that's very useful. Well, very you know, useful. Two weeks ago, we actually used the system in the, at the neurosurgery intervention in the Elizabeth Hospital in Tilburg. Uh, which really is breaking news for us because this is the first time that this system is used on the OR during an intervention. Um, they actually uh, changed the intervention uh, strategy because of what they were able to see. So they saw an area and said, okay, we don't want to go into that area because it's, it's more dangerous for the patient. So they moved into a different way. And also during the interventions, they did a couple of checks with the 3D model, 
to make sure that they were on the right spot inside the patient. So it's very interesting uh, uh, to see this evolving into the clinical applications. CTMM makes innovative public-private partnerships a reality. SMEs partnering with universities, academic medical centers and large enterprises to obtain the best results for patients, to improve healthcare savings and to stimulate economic growth.